what is up bros this is our broom and i'm back with panzer core and our 1939 grand campaign ready to continue our invasion of poland so next up it looks like we've got the danzig corridor september 5th 1939 thanks largely to your efforts in crippling the polish air force our forces in the northern sector have successfully reunited East Prussia with Germany and utterly crushed the so-called Danzig Corridor. In order to maintain control of this area and to continue our advance into Poland, it is vital that you secure several bridges, rail crossings, and cities along the Vistula River. You should expect no resistance from the Polish Air Force, but be prepared for heavy ground resistance from newly mobilized Polish troops Success here will open up new avenues in the drive to Warsaw, but failure could be disastrous. Good luck, Herr General. So it looks like we have a decisive victory is capture all objectives. A marginal victory, capture at least three. And we've got 14 rounds to do it in. And this is the map. All right, so we own the entire north. We got a nice army here to begin with, and our placement is down here. And we've got to capture one, two, three, four, five, six positions in 14 rounds. I think we can do it, bros. Let me go ahead and get these uh, units back up to strength, get them placed, and we will begin. Alright bros, got my units placed. We are ready for day one. Danzig Corridor. Looks like we've got some more uh, winged hussars to take care of. Noise. Starting out with a six damage. Aiming a five damage. Of course, remember last last mission. You know, it started out where we were whooping up on him, and then uh, the resistance got stiffer. I wonder why the anti-tank artillery can capture. But the regular artillery cannot capture, like the field artillery. Oh! Winged Hussars go down. Damn, my bros are getting a good start here. These must not be the like the newly formed troops that they were talking about in the briefing. Alright, Poland again does nothing on the first day. Day two. Look at that damage my bros are thrown down. Already with the... How many cities have we captured already? Two or three? Actually using that recon aircraft. Ooh, they got a nice defense there. Captured two cities. Captured three cities. Captured four cities in only two rounds. That's pretty good. So buy some more mountain division troops. Actually, I want to place them up front. So we'll wait till we can put them up here on the front. I don't want to put them all the way in the back. And another winged hussar goes down. 
Two more cities fall. This had to be just pretty much what it was like. Just city after city falling. Damn near instantly. I feel like I should... I want another Stuka dive bomber at some point when I can afford it. I was not sold on any of the other bombers. Strategic or tactical. I mean, they do some suppression and stuff like that, but... I like the Stukas. They actually do reliable damage. Sure, there is a time and place where you would probably rather have some suppression. But I'm all about the I'm all about the Stuka right now. Anti-air. Ha! Can we do it now? No, we can... Well, we can put it down there. I want one up... I want them up here. Where this starter force that... was kind of weak was placed. Damn! Bringing out the winged hussars! Four of them! All right, we have captured the bridge. Ah, oh, winged hussar. Rip. Wrong way to withdraw, bro. Did an oopsie. You would usually want to do a strategic withdrawal um, towards your front, not <laughs> into the enemy front. Nice, no damage. Always enjoyable. There, we can place some units up close. Oh, he's gonna die. Pepper's not gonna make it on that bridge. Rip! Alright, that's my one unit that I allow myself to loot. Oh, damn, he threw down eight damage all right bros I gotta get my shit together that's the one unit I allow myself to lose per round or per episode permission something like that The winged hussars are just no match, even for our crappy panzers. We're talking panzer ones and twos. Like the real craptastic stuff. So it looks like... Nice. Poland's one and only like a medium tanks down here. Try to put an end to him. No match for the Panzer 34, 30, 38. 
seconds or 38 too strong. I'm just gonna let whatever come at me come at me and fight from that bridge. See, I know if you cross a river, um, your defense is down. I don't know if you fight on a bridge if your defense is down, though. Obviously, it wouldn't be as much as fighting on the river. I don't know if it is at all, though. Look at that Stuka action throwing down a four. Oh, we have busted out of here. Poor Calvary. They had their time and place, it, it isn't now. Even the German infantry wrecked the Polish cavalry. They don't have too many units that are at full strength. Day seven, halfway. Polish cavalry is, um, brave. They will straight up charge a tank. I've heard stories about that. Nice, that's the end of their cavalry. Halfway there, I don't see us having a problem. We only got to capture three. Three cities and a bridge. And there's the bridge. Day number eight. Making sure this Danzig quarters opened up more. Bears are about to get flanked here. Get some of my units upgraded for the final push. Nice.
telling you. When I played the uh, original campaign and my bombers never did any damage, I was just like, you know... Bombers aren't even worth it. I'm just going to use the fighters. That was before I met up with the feared Stuka dive bomber close support aircraft. I'm a believer now. Look at just throwing down fours, just wrecking Polish equipment. Now I, I know, like I don't have to go north and take that one city, but if I can, I like to take everything on the map before before the level ends. So I'm gonna do that. Captured our bridge. Day 10. Nice! Another Polish strategic point gets crushed. And you Polish bros to the north. Don't think that the Wehrmacht has forgot about you. Damn, look, even the BF 109's getting involved. He didn't want the Stuka getting all the credit. So it appears like the Poles have three artillery pieces and two infantry divisions left. Let me go ahead and just reinforce all these for the final push. Make that two artillery and two infantry. That's it, I guess. For day, what was that? 10? Yep, we are ready for day 11. Damn, bros up here aren't going down easy, are they? A one damage and a no damage. And then there was but one artillery and two infantry divisions. And then there was but two infantry divisions. The breakthrough of the Polish corridor has been expanded. Day number 12. Should be a wrap here. I trust the Stuka with my life right now. Everything I ask of it, it does. Is there nothing that the Stuka cannot do? There we go, that's it. Captured everything. Oh. Captured everything. Yep. Noise. Decisive victory, bros.
excellently performed. Your forces have swept all opposition in your path and at long last, East Prussia has been reunited with Greater Germany. Now is not the time for celebration, Herr General. The war rages on. Bros, if you're enjoying this content, you know what to do. Slap the like and subscribe. Hit the notification bell. And I will see you back here for our next upload. Peace. Ruminati out.